Hello everybody, and welcome to your inside look at Single Point Incorporated. I'm David, I'm going to be guiding you through this little video I've put together. Uh, we're going to be looking at three major points uh, with Single Point, starting with the company information, you know, take it just a general look at some share structure, and uh, we're going to move from there to product offerings, talk about what they've got going on for them in terms of products and things like that, and then we'll end up on some recent news and developments that I wanted to talk about, and uh, I'm ready to go. So if you guys are, stay tuned, we're going to get started here. All right, I've uh, jumped on over to otcmarkets.com where you can pull up a bunch of information about the share structure company profile, things like that. I want to go over some of this with you here. Single point trades currently in the OTC pink market under the ticker symbol of SING. The company was incorporated in 2006 by Greg Lambrecht, uh, who is still currently calling all the shots as the CEO, CFO, President, IR, and General Counsel hybrid. Uh, SING is classified as a development stage services company with their most recent annual report going to print on December 31st of 2013. Uh, their current market value is just over 4.76 million dollars and um, with over 256 million shares outstanding in total there is uh, there are 530 million authorized shares with a float of 168.3 million shares so um, all this information is actually very current um, the authorized shares shares outstanding float that's all current as of March 28th of 2014 with a market value of that 4.7 million uh, as of May 9th 2014 so uh, company information is up to date here you can take a look at it on your screens point out some of the interesting things we've just talked about some of the uh, the share structure and uh, incorporation so uh, take a look at this pause the video if you have to and when you come back we're gonna be taking a look at uh, product offering some of the things that SING has to offer uh, to its investors and uh, you know the market as a whole Now we're back over here at the single point website that's singlepoint.com you can type that into your web browser and get some more information about this as well I'm just gonna be kind of breezing through the front page here uh, Single Point is currently trying to make a large impact into the mobile payment industry, which is currently, uh, you know, spearheaded by PayPal. It's definitely one of the dominant uh, forms of mobile payment. Where Single Point is trying to, you know, break in and trying to really make their name is uh, in their mobile payment program, allowing customers to pay with text messages as opposed to a smartphone app. Now, 87% of American adults own a cell phone capable of texting, so obviously that's a huge market. For them and they plan to uh, you know make money by charging a one dollar fee plus five percent for every transaction that is made up to fifty thousand dollars that's a lot of potential profit here but potential is the key word as PayPal does have such a large market and so many people do have smartphones that text messaging as a form of payment could be seen as almost obsolete however moving on uh, from that and moving onward of that they are very interested in the marijuana industry where there has been complications through the payment processors uh, traditional payment processors have been afraid of being shut down by the federal government so this this form of cash payment is uh, really appealing to a large vastly growing very profitable market right now so uh, they could have a strong leg up there the legal uh, marijuana industry is estimated to be worth two billion dollars and with 87 percent of Americans owning that cell phone capable of texting that's a huge stake into that two billion dollar market um, it'll be interesting to see where this develops from there and moves on from there as it is a uh, you know as it is kind of an oversaturated market um, you can get a free trial of it here you know take a look at it you know get a feel for it for yourself uh, we're gonna come up here bounce up to products real quick they have quite a few different ones here that you can take a look at I don't want to get into all these right here there's a couple other things I wanted to touch on and I don't want to take up too much of your time so come out come here check out their products I'll put it in the description below for you as well and I want to move on to news there's been a couple new uh, news announcements lately that are looking pretty exciting so uh, we're gonna head on right over there Another significant portion of SING's uh, business is mobile marketing. Now, while they do have mobile apps, they're also pushing their marketing of it as well. And this was recently announced in their uh, uh, April 22nd news release here of Single Point launching the Legal 420 Dynamic Smartphone application with uh, database directories and services. All these things were kind of just featured into this application. Now, uh, this came out, like I said, on April 22nd. Um, it was an app for medical marijuana industry. It connects patients and doctors with dispensaries and uh, patients with doctors and dispensaries. And uh, it also gives information on states by state legislation and informs 
and uh, informs users on procurement of ID cards for legal use, etc. Um, this is a very uh, strategic approach, I'd say. Uh, it's a very interesting application here. It also has a uh, little bit of a connection to PTOO, and uh, you know the application seems to be received pretty well. And like I said, this is kind of trying to break them into that um, you know that medical marijuana industry where they have the uh, the advantage of this mobile texting uh, payment process. Um, this is also a big step forward for their marketing as well. So we'll see where this goes. And uh, I thought this was very interesting. This is a very pertinent uh, update here. Uh, there was one other one that I liked as well. It was uh, this one here where they executed a letter of intent to acquire digital signage network from a digital advertising pioneer, uh, Drive Media Networks, LLC. Um, this was an exciting little article that I read that came out on May 7th, so fairly recently here. And um, excuse me, this uh, advances the company's offering of comprehensive marketing, CRM, and payment solutions to clients. Drive Media's management team is planning on joining SING, uh, bringing in more than 30 years of collective experience with them. And uh, it was all just a really uh, interesting article. I highly recommend you read this one. I'll put it in the description as well. Uh, initially, Drive Media screens, uh, Drive Media offers screens and things like that, and they will initially be placed and installed in medical and recreational cannabis dispensaries nationwide. This is uh, what I've read is supposed to speed up the process a lot, and uh, you know, faster things go, the more money can be made. So. Uh, they also said that the acquisition that they're, they got right here uh, should immediately create additional revenues for SING. And uh, some of the projections that were mentioned in this article show over $1 million in net income over the next five years. So take a look at this. The marketing approach that SING is doing is very well uh, thought out here. It looks like they're doing a pretty nice job of it. As, for, uh, as far as their mobile payment programs go, it fits in well with the medical marijuana industry right now. As uh, you know, there has been that scare from the federal government and uh, shutting down uh, traditional payment processors. So this non-traditional text message form of payment uh, should uh, or could rather get a nice little foothold. We'll have to see what happens. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you got some uh, good information out of this. Uh, like I said, all the links will be down in the description below. Please talk amongst yourselves. Ask any questions. I'll be happy to help. And uh, subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you again soon.